All right, well, you really do have to be fast. Hey guys, it's Jag. Welcome back to the arcade. Let's get back to just another game. Smashy, smashy. The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. And uh, it only took a couple of tries to get this puzzle done, but you really have to do things in the right order. That's the key. It really does help if you can shoot this switch from that switch over there. And it's not the easiest shot to make in the world, but whatever. We have two things. We have a whirlwind and we have a hole to explore. Let's check out the hole first. Link's very excited about the hole. Ah, another arena. Okay. With dudes. There's a rat dude, there's a bacoblin. What else we got being thrown at us? More rat dudes, cool. More rat dudes, more bacoblins. I really should probably start fishing from those guys. Ah. Okay, good. You do not die. Uh, I, I wasn't locked on anybody. This feels like a good opportunity to get at least some more penance. As long as the rat demons leave me alone. Oh, hey! That's a jump in difficulty. We just hit the difficulty spike. Now we got a dark nut and a moblin. Okay. This is getting... This is getting real. Real... It's... S is getting real right here. Uh, also I want to know what just rang on my phone. I don't know if you guys picked that up. I heard it. Hang on a second. Let's uh... Let's just not take a risk here and put that back on mute like it should be. And I'll check that out later. Right now, I got... I have quite the... Ooh! I like that you hurt that guy. That's definitely a notch in your belt. I will kill you with prejudice because of it. More moblins. And the Dark Knight is just taking the opportunity to smack the crap out of me. I think he's dead. Lots of spoils. And now we have another Dark Knight, but I can actually kind of focus on this one. Come on. Give me your prop. Ah. Uh, well, so much for being able to focus on the dark nut. Ow. Uh. Oh, good. Wiz robes are here. Wiz robes are here. All right. We need to start assigning some priorities. Which is really hard because Z targeting wants to uh, close in on the nearest thing. Ow! I mean, the only good thing right now is the Dark Nut is also smacking the crap out of everything else. Also, I have two fairies and blue potion, although I would prefer not to use any of those if I don't have to. That Dark Knight is uh, definitely complicating things. So are the damn Nanas. Are those just going to spawn infinitely? I would really prefer they did not. Uh, okay, are we down to the Wish Robes, the Moblins, and the Dark Knight? This feels like... No! Alright, I can finally strike your helmet and your armor. I have a moment to focus on you. Just a little moment. Uh, is that not quite it? More you guys. Another dark nut. We got a whole new wave here. Wow. Oh, that whiz robe is not gonna make things happy for me. All right, there goes your armor. Uh, 
I don't even have time to fish or talk or do commentary or anything. Man, it is it is wild down here. This is okay. Three dark nuts. Three dark nuts. Oh joy. What am I getting for all this? Uh besides killed. Alright, cool. I took his armor off just in time. I like that. Well, I took off a helmet, then got two helmets, and they got smacked down hard. Alright, let's try to keep them in a, um, in a group here. Ouch! Uh, that's not gonna help me. That's not gonna help me at all. Bo will save me. Maybe. This is quite the start to this episode, not gonna lie. Ow. Couple of hits, couple of hits. Ouch. Alright, that's... One down. Ow. I do not like you having access to one of those pole arms. That's even worse than your normal sword. All right, you're my last dude. I missed the prompt. Look at all these weapons. Look at all these weapons everywhere. There are weapons everywhere. Is that it? Oh my god! That was a battle. Holy crap! We've been doing that for... Well, I guess I can't say we've been doing that for 10 minutes, but we've been doing that for a while. Wow! And for that, we get a silver rupee. One is worth a whopping 200 rupees. It's time to jump for joy. Well, I do need the money. More importantly, there is a lot of goodies. and. I have my choice of swords. I have started Link's Armory down here. Come down here for all your weapons needs. Look at all this stuff. Man, I really wish I could actually carry this with me and sell it. What do I need the Knight's Crests for anyway? I could probably just start selling those to be perfectly honest. They would probably actually get a really good price. I'm probably going to want to look into that more before I do it, but wow. That was... That was crazy. That was a crazy way to start the episode. Alright, now, this whirlwind... Where'd it go? Oh, the whirlwind's gone. Well, hmm. Don't want to try to activate this again. Probably should explore the whirlwind before I went in the hole. Let's try it. Let's... I think I got the way to do this. Let's just clear things out a little bit. And, uh, then... Let's see where that whirlwind goes, because I think that goes to the top of the island. If you do it right. I think that's the only way up there, and I do kind of want to see what's up there. Maybe there's another treasure chest up there. Defo deforesting this area really did help me get from place to place. In a quick manner. So let's make sure I get these trees over here. Oh, man. I'm actually shaking a little bit. I... that... That was a challenge! That was probably the first... Hang on a sec. Probably the first real combat challenge we've had in a while. Just so many things to pay attention to. And so many distractions. And even after all that, I am still full... Oh, I need to bring out my hammer. I am still full on arrows and bombs. I am never going to get anything from Beetle Shop at this rate. Alright. Roll, 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 roll. Roll, 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 roll. Rolling. No! Into the ocean. Well, that's gonna screw the pooch. That is the trick to getting to that last little bit, is it's really easy to fall into the ocean. 
And you only have one shot at this, basically. Alright. Wow, look at that. Right behind the grass. Cool. Shark Island is... Definitely... Living up to, uh, being challenging. I'll give it that. Alright, this time not into the ocean. Speed run rolls. Speed run rolls. That did it. Cool. Yeah, a little bit of practice never hurt. Alright, now we need to set the wind. Because that's not moving. We need to set the wind in that direction. So what direction is that? Face it. Uh, there we go. Gotta remember how to do this, actually. It's been a little while. Probably should take off the boots. I bet I can't fly with the boots. Oop, I set it to the north. I did not want to set it to the north. I... I am bad. Play the Triforce song again. Yeah, I want to set it that way. I guess the wind was kind of where I wanted it to go, but... I think we need to hit that whirlwind and then float to the top. So we're going to see how well this works. Come on, give me a boost. Uh, actually, yeah, I'm going to fight the wind too hard. It's actually going to be better, I think, to fight the wind to the whirlpool or to the tornado and then use the wind to boost my way back onto the top of the island. What an interesting challenge. Okay. So what I want to do is uh, I want to set it this way. Let's try it. I'm not sure I did the right thing. Uh, no, I did not. Uh, what is up there that could possibly be worth this kind of trouble? I have no idea. All right. Which way is the wind blowing? So if I'm facing to the southwest, wow, it's not going to even tell me. That's irritating. Okay, no, it is definitely going to be against, I see the, I see which way the wind is blowing. It needs to blow the exact opposite way. No wonder I can't get to the tornado. Might want to research this before I get started. Yeah, it needs to blow that way. There we go. Now, let's see here. If I can fight the wind a little bit to get to the whirlwind, but this is still much easier. And now, we use the wind to our advantage, or we run out of magic. We run out of magic. Okay, you know what? I've got a solution to that. We need to heal anyway. Where's... I don't have... Uh... Yeah, okay. We'll use Elixir Soup. <laughs> he looks so happy with it. Look, he loves that soup. We haven't used it in a while. It's a good opportunity to use it to refill everything, and we can always pick up more for free. Sorry, right, let's try this again. Fight the wind a little bit just to get to the whirlwind. Get up in the whirlwind. And now it's easy sailing. Easy sailing. Easy sailing. I got it. Put away the elixir suit. Oh, blue chew. Okay, good to see you. Oh, do not fall off in the ocean, Link. 
Is that all that was up here? Just the blue chew and some money? Okay. Well, chew jelly's chew jelly. Okay, well, that is Shark Island thoroughly explored, and I'm pretty sure it's cleaned out. Where should we go from here? Um, let's take a look at the map. Uh, let's, uh, assist the mother and child owls. I think we want to go right there. Let's start with that. I think we have a treasure chart for that area there. And we might just go and do a bunch of treasure charts this uh, this episode. Get them knocked out. We have like six or so that we can get items from and or money. And I would like both of those things. So why not? All right. Uh, no, 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 no. Do not warp there. Yes, we'll warp to Tingle Island. That's okay. <laughs> Do not want to warp to the Mother and Child Islands. Do not. That would be very bad. Alright, let's see here. I'm gonna go west. Uh, west is not that way. That is east. This is west. That's a Gior. We're leaving. You're going to just keep taunting me until I take you out, aren't you? There. Hope you're happy. I hope death is everything you wanted out of life. Let's go. Okay. I think this might be... Let's check. No, I think we got it, actually. Treasure chart 2? Yeah, I think we did get... Alright, we did get that. Uh, we did that the last episode. What else we got going on here? Hmm, treasure chart 9. Treasure chart 9? Um... Hmm, okay. Let's go home. <laughs> Instead. I'm not gonna waste much of a trip out here. go to Outset Island. Yes. We'll go to Outset Island. We'll pick up Treasure Chart 9. Maybe we'll go see one of the shrines. I'm still trying to decide what I want to do. I kind of feel like I still want to do some exploring, but it has been so long since we did any story. It might actually start be getting time to do some story. But let's explore where Treasure Chart 9 is first. Actually, let's go get this money. Definitely, definitely want to get the money. I wonder if I should just, like, farm all of these rings off screen. Once we get the chart, which means, you know, we got to go do the reefs. But once we get the chart, maybe I should just sail around and get all the light rings off screen. Spend a few hours doing that. I don't know. 50 rubies! Always good. We're building up our wealth. <clears throat> A little bit. We actually almost have... Oh, there's some more money over there. We're kind of getting to the point where we just want to use it on charts. I mean, I still have to shop at Beetles. No, not close enough. But the big thing is going to be using it on those three charts. Uh, where'd the light ring go? There it is. But yeah, I'm starting to think that it might be time to get back to at least talking about the shrines and going to see what we need to do there. We can always do more side questing later, and we probably will, but this might be the last side quest episode for at least a little while. At least a few episodes. Okay. And we're going to make the most of it by getting even more money, apparently. Right on top of it. Sorry, that was my phone again. 
people texting me when I'm recording. Don't they know I'm recording? Also, I need to remember to put my phone on mute. So really, it's their fault, not mine, though. Man, it, I know I've mentioned it before, but night just lasts so long. I don't know why. Now it's finally getting ticking over to dawn. But I really don't like sailing around at night. I like hearing... I like hearing the music. I like hearing the adventuring Great Sea Zelda theme music. That's the best. In fact, that's one of the my only real complaints about Ocarina of Time is they did not have the traditional Zelda music for going around Hyrule Field and I was so disappointed by that. I was really glad that they brought it back in um, Majora's Mask. Alright, what do we got here? This is a reef. This is definitely a reef. Uh, do I want to conquer this? I, I did want to do this all in one episode, but uh, wow, look at all this money. But I feel like that would be a lot for one episode, what with conquering it and the travel time? Hmm. There's a lot of money here, actually. Actually, I don't want to... I will come back for this. Uh, I don't want to do this right now. I want to go to Horseshoe Island. And I am too far north. I need to go... Right about there? Yeah. That's where we want to go. Whee! Yeah, I don't... I want to do Horseshoe Island. I don't want to do the reef. I'm kind of tempted by it. Because we're right there, and I do need to do it at one point. But, I don't want to do it right now. I just don't. I want to go do, like, Horseshoe Island's got something that's going to be really unique on it. And I want to go ahead and give that a try. Not only will we get a treasure chest, or a uh, salvage chest, but we might get a treasure chest too. Wow, I got foggy. I didn't know the Great Sea could get this foggy. Also, are those sea hats? I feel like those are sea hats. Those are definitely sea hats. Why are there sea hats? There we go, there's our treasure. And Mapfish. We haven't talked to Mapfish in a while. Wow, the slowdown is real. That sea hat really slowed the game down as it came in. I don't even know what was up with that. I think it may have been the fog. And where's the light ring? I lost the light ring. I mean, I heard it, but I don't see it. Alright, no more fog. My light ring's back. The sea hat's coming after me. That's cool. Right here. I think I'm practically on top of it. Oh yeah. Didn't have to go down very far at all. Money! Yay! More money. I'm actually closing in on 2,000 rupees. Matt Fish, would you like to share in my bounty and tell me about this island? I will pull out my bait and you will give me a map and information. Hopefully useful. Before I get knocked overboard by a, a sea hat. Boy, small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard. Yes, I do want to chart an information about this island, not another island, this one. Horseshoe Island. Cool. On the island due east of here lives an old man who is... Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, I know what that thing is. Well, too bad I can't go give away every secret. I've already, we already know about him. I'm not reading that. That's nothing to do with this island. That's about, Osh uh, not Oceus. Oceus is in Phantom Hourglass. Orca. That's what I'm thinking of. Okay, so this is a little bit different of a challenge. This is actually kind of a golf course. We need to push these pods, or golf these pods. into that there hole. 
And I need to reset it. Are you not going to reset? The thorns not resetting kind of screw this up. Okay. It can go through the thorns, but yeah, we just need to get the thing in the hole all the way around. I actually kind of like this little mini game. Wish they did more about it. Uh, pretty lined up. Another swing. Yeah, that's in. I am an expert golfer. Don't let my dad tell you otherwise. I am not terrible. Ooh. You are not a golfer, but you have something I want. My dad used to take me to the driving range as a kid, and um, I actually kind of uh, <laughs> threw my golf club down the course. A little bit off, uh, a little bit too steep of an angle. Let's try this one. All right, I need to line up like this, maybe? Tell you what I do love, though, more than anything else, is going to Putt-Putt. I have so many good memories of Putt-Putt. Used to go there all the time as a kid. How come you don't see more Putt-Putts around? Uh, is that one of those things that just went like, you know, Blockbuster and everything else in the 90s. It's just gone forever. Alright, there's a hole. There's a dude. What are you looking at, dude? Oh, so beautiful. Incredibly beautiful. <laughs> I'm so glad I bought this kaleidoscope. Alright, so you're not looking at anything. Alright, um, hmm. Let's go. Well, I guess we're going in the hole first. Hopefully that doesn't despawn the chest. Oh! Been a while since we saw Mothula and its larvae. But in that time, we have a bow. Which is going to make this really trivial. Is that all you got? Is that all you got, game? You just have a Mothula and a couple of larvae. I snicker at you. You did bring me the creepy little stumpy dudes, though. Hey, we got another treasure chart. Yeah, yeah, open the chart on the map screen and blah, blah, blah. All right. Let's get rid of you. Do you come out with me or do I leave you behind? You're trying to come out with me. Nope, you're gone. Okay, do I need to solve this again? No, good. I just need to set the wind the correct way and I'll fly over to see what else we got. That looks about right. I, do, I don't really like that it's always a top-down view of links. Sometimes that's useful, sometimes it's not. What's in here? Probably another treasure chart. Yep, you got a treasure chart. Hooray, open this chart on the map screen in a place for blah blah blahs. All right, two more treasure charts. Two islands. Really conquered? And I kind of feel like I hear ominous music. Why do I hear ominous music up here? Oh, I bet it's because of that sea hat. All right, let's get out of here. We're done here. And I think we're going to call it an episode here. I just looked at my recording, and uh, even if I cut out some of the beginning, we're going to be going a little bit long. So, uh, thanks for coming out and joining me today. As always, I much appreciate it. If you guys enjoyed what you saw, make sure you let me know by leaving me that thumbs up. If you're new to the channel and you want to see more Wind Waker, subscribe because I upload it every weekday. And if you have any hints, tips, or tricks, make sure to leave a comment. Thanks for watching again, and I'll see you next time. Y'all have a great day. Later.